Hi everyone, Miss Rogers here of the Learning Commons, and today I want to tell you about this fabulous book called The Honeys by Ryan LaSala. This book is in our horror section, which when people have seen me lately with holding this book, um, they're surprised because the cover, and I agree, is so surprisingly beautiful for a horror book, but my gosh, is it perfectly designed to match the tone of this book. You can see the honeys starts to become a little fuzzy and, and uh, strange looking at the bottom. So everything but the opening scene. The opening scene was shocking to me. So our main character, Mars, is asleep. And Mars's twin sister comes into their room through the window and starts attacking, physically attacking Mars and trying to kill them. Um, the sister ends up dead by her own mistake at the end of this terrible encounter. So the first mystery is why? They were really close siblings. They're twins. What was the sister, Caroline is her name, what was Caroline doing? Why? And of course, mourning her death. Okay, so what follows is Mars decides to return to the elite summer camp that Caroline continued to attend, but Mars stopped attending for what we can tell is some traumatic reason. Mars wants to understand their sister's change over the recent years. This is what is fascinating about this book. Mars realizes things with clarity about the camp in the moment. And then we remember what Mars experienced or realized, but Mars's memory of it becomes fuzzier and fuzzier and maybe even leaves completely. So it's this fascinating experience where we know more than the main character who's telling us this story. But there are these girls at the camp called the Honeys. Um, they used to be like a working class group, which is why they called them the Honeys. They were like the honeybees. It was like a, a a mean name to call the group and they became more and more powerful and took ownership of the name and there's lots of bees references in the novel and um, they gather honey from bees and we know that they are somehow responsible for mars's fading fuzzy memories and Mars is not the only one to experience that at the camp it seems like everyone can totally forget that a person existed so we know that even though Mars's memories are fuzzy, that Mars is the only person who can ultimately figure out what the honeys are doing and why their sister tried to murder them at the beginning of the book. It's weird. It's lovely. It's fascinating. Mars is a really great, wonderful narrator. I highly recommend The Honeys by Ryan LaSala.